As a Russell Group University, our students are very sought after. We have employers coming to us asking for our students because they really want them for work experience or grad role. I'm Poppy Beacock, I'm one of the Employability and Placement Officers and I work for the Faculty of Engineering and Physical Science. My role as an Employability and Placement Officer is all about helping students to gain work experience alongside their degree programmes. So we work very closely with employers and we make sure we build links in the STEM sector. We secure exclusive opportunities for students that they can apply to and we make sure that we're really familiar with the recruitment processes to help the student be in the best possible position when applying for those opportunities. Students really go to a wide range of companies. Previously and in this year, that's included BMW, Mott McDonald, Unilever, AstraZeneca, Deloitte, Met Office. We encourage you to find a company that really suits what you're looking for and really matches the type of work that you're interested in as well. A placement year is very beneficial to a student's degree outcome. An industrial placement year is a 9 to 13 month opportunity that you take with an employer and is part of your degree programme. You get a real chance to build your confidence and build your skills. It also has really tangible benefits as well. So we find that when students return, they tend to perform better academically and are more likely to get a 2-1 or a first class indication. We tend to find that students come back from placement more engaged with their studies as well. It's something that really helps them to build their confidence. So being in that position for a year, but a developmental position, you get your graduate job faster, you get to secure the salary that you want, and you get to secure it in the industry that you want, compared to people that don't have work experience. When you're on an industrial placement year, you'll get a dedicated placement tutor and they'll be there to support you as part of your placement to help advise you both academically, but also to make sure you're developing yourself professionally. You'll have two meetings with that academic personal tutor as part of your placement year, but there's also other opportunities that you can contact them. I know a lot of our tutors will have email correspondence as well with their tutees while set on their placement. When you're on an industrial placement year, there is a reduced tuition fee. You can also apply um, if relevant to student finance, again, for reduced student finance fees for the year. Another option for you to get work experience is a summer internship. These differ because they're a lot shorter in length, they tend to be between 8 and 12 weeks. A summer internship is a really good way to dip your toe into different types of employers, different work opportunities and just find what you like. You'll tend to find because it's 8 to 12 weeks, you might work on one particular project and really build your skills in that area. The university isn't part of these, so that's where it's different to a, a placement year. There is no assessment, you don't need approval to go on a summer internship, but we do absolutely support you to gain that work experience. And again, we work with a lot of employers to secure either exclusive opportunities or to help to time push you to employers. The process to secure a summer internship is very similar to securing an industrial placement year. So you'll get all the same support. We have those one-to-one -one appointments that you can book and we also have a wide range of online materials that you can access, ranging from how to build your CV, how to write a cover letter, where to look for those opportunities. We can advise on different aspects of the recruitment process for both the summer internships and industrial placement year. We provide mock interviews as well to make sure that you've got that chance to practice before a real interview. We also work to promote international opportunities. So for example, we have a, a summer internship exchange programme with Kaish University in South Korea. Um, a really exciting opportunity to go work in South Korea for the summer and do your internship over there. There's other schemes as well, such as Alberta in Canada, and we're always working to increase our international reach and make sure we are providing those opportunities to you. During term time, students can find us in our dedicated employability suite that is for students in the Faculty of Engineering and Physical Science. There's always going to be a friendly face here for you so you can drop in and see us. We also offer online appointments, so for a student that perhaps wants to speak to us online, you can do that. And then we have resources that you can use 24 seven at a time that best suits you. Once you graduate, you still get access to our service. We have a qualified careers consultant in this faculty, but also centrally, we have a wide range of qualified careers consultants that can support you. And even after graduation, you can still access these services and you can still access this support. For prospective students looking to gain work experience before you start your course, which is a really good idea and something I'd encourage you to do, there are lots of really useful websites that you could use to help you with this. Student Ladder, E4S, and Forage all have really good opportunities for six formers, college age students, school leavers to find work experience. You can also use this chance to start building your LinkedIn. It's never too early to get a LinkedIn account, start networking, add in employers. If you are interested and you want to find out more, if you have more questions, you can email us at epsemployability at leads.ac.uk. I'm one of three people that does this role. We're all super, super friendly um, and we're very supportive for making sure that we 
secure lots of inclusive roles um, and promote lots of inclusivity across STEM roles.